I don't want to see another Democrat replaced by a Republican. I genuinely, in my spirit, believe that that is dangerous for everyday people, like legitimately dangerous. Um, so none of us want to see Mikey Sherrill get replaced by a Republican, right? But on top of that, there are ways to protect Mikey Sherrill that don't throw black voters under the bus. And what the the talk is from folks who, from political insiders who have personal reasons for wanting to put all of Montclair into NJ11 is we need this in order to protect Mikey. Number one, that isn't true. There are other ways to draw the map that actually make NJ11 more democratic and actually mean democratic that don't include cutting out black voters from Montclair. So number one, that's not true. But number two, even if they did do it, that would make those black voters only have a, about a 6% um, black voters in that area. So NJ11 would only have about 6% black voters and it would be overwhelmingly white. So it's something in like the 60 plus range of white voters, which then when it comes to issues like, hey, let's just be frank here, policing, over militarization of police, CRT, critical race theory, which we've known is going to be, you know, a, a very big issue and, it, and Republicans have made it a big issue. But those things are very, very important to black voters and black people. And you're going to place this amount of black voters, which would only then bring the voting population, the black voter population, NJ11 to 6%, you're going to place them in an overwhelmingly white district where their votes aren't gonna matter because they're never going to have enough numbers to have things that they want. And then also their cultural background really isn't gonna matter much because they don't have much numbers. And so why hurt black voters in that way when there are other ways to cut districts that place people who are culturally more similar to NJ11, who are financially more similar to NJ11, who are racially more similar to NJ11, protect Mikey that way, and then not hurt that slice of black voters.